Hello, hello there, my crafty friends. It's Candy here from SweetStamper.com, and I have missed you. This is my first broadcast since, um, well, since we turned the calendar, and we're in the year of 2022. So I had a little break, went away for Christmas vacation, and I did miss uh, hanging out with y'all and stamping with you and sharing fun, creative things. Hey, Laura, I'm glad you're here with me live. But I will say the break did me good and I came back raring to go. So today is of course the launch of our brand new spring catalog. So happy new year to you, Laura, and happy new year to everyone who is watching both live and in the replay. So I do ask if you come on later and you watch the replay, if you will just put replay in the comments, that helps me. And if you are watching on YouTube, because I do download these recordings and play them on YouTube for those who are either just not on Facebook, I know it seems like the whole world is here, but many people are not on Facebook. And then also people who just prefer the uh, convenience of going on YouTube because you don't have to hunt and peck and try to find um, my latest live. They're just all right there, all categorized and everything. So if you're watching on YouTube, I would really appreciate uh, one of those thumbs ups. That really helps uh, the whole algorithm and the way that um, they categorize our, excuse me, our videos and things. Hey, Linda, I'm glad you're here with me live. So we are going to do a quick catalog walkthrough. Hopefully you have your catalog by now. There are, well, there's two catalogs. So having said that, yes, I'm gonna have to, I have it in front of me. I have one in front of me and one that is, um, I've got to grab so that I can share with you and we are going to go through this together. I do have a few, I have some swaps to share with you, but I don't wanna share too much all at once because I know for me, I get a little bit overwhelmed and so, that's the way my brain works, and so I'm thinking there may be a few other people that find that it's more productive and um, more, what's the word I'm looking for, more beneficial to kind of go through in bits and pieces. So with all that being said, we are going to flip the camera down and go live. So give me just a moment. Hey, Mary, I'm glad you're here. Happy New Year to you. Let me have just a minute to uh, get lined up here on camera to make sure that I'm, I'm seeing what you're seeing so that we are in camera. Those of you who are live here in San Antonio with me, um, I am doing my regular now monthly card class um, on the 15th. And that means we will be using all brand new stamps and papers. So... I would encourage you to get registered for that if you haven't already so that you can see all my beautiful displays and you know there's nothing like getting your hands on the the new things and um, playing with them and creating with them and trying them out um, seeing is definitely believing and hmm. oh I see what I'm doing here here we go mirror image on this thing you'd think as long as i've been doing facebook live i'd have this down but no <laughs> never a dull moment for me okay now i think we're pretty well centered now and hopefully you have a copy of this so hard copy i did send out the link in my newsletter this morning and uh so this is the gorgeous gorgeous catalog front love it with one of our new suites one of our new ribbons, and of course, an actual tulip where there is a whole suite of tulips. So um, I love that at the beginning um, of the, this is the actual mini catalog, which is, um, I sometimes call the spring catalog because it's still that way to me. Um, so you do have a table of contents here. It does tell you about the product suites. And that helps you. Also, the indexes at the back I find incredibly helpful. I don't know if anybody else likes to go to the back first. Um, but you will have the um, host stamp sets at the back and then also the different indexes. Now, this is about hosting and rewarding and joining. But the indexes is what I wanted to bring to your attention. 
And these are just amazing because you have them categorized in the punches, um, the embossing folders, the paper. So if you're looking for something, I like to go to the back to the um, index and start looking. And thankfully, they have now started putting the index in alphabetical order. And I know that for me, my brain always goes in alphabetical, so I'm really grateful for this. And that also, if you keep going towards the front now, you'll see in the index all of the dies and then the stamp sets. And I again, I love that these are all in alphabetical. Now, having said that, you have to have the, <laughs> the name of the item in your head or you know, there is just a little uh, icon photo. Um, and then you have all of the bundles here as well. So this is all of the index, and that is enormously helpful. Now going back up to the front again, it does tell you that the indexes are on page 76 all the way to 87. So there's a lot of index there for you. And they do also give you as well uh, the various icons, the 10% icon is, of course, for bundles. We get bundle prices only when bundles are introduced. So this is the thing to remember. When we have brand new items, we have brand new stamp sets and dies that coordinate, um, stamp set and punch that coordinate, things like that. Those bundled savings are 10%. They are not lifelong. So in other words, if that, that item, if those two items make it into the next catalog, for instance, the new annual catalog, which will come out in May, you typically will not get that 10% savings again. So, you know, if there's something new, you want to get that bundle price while you can. Um, the little clock, I love that because that tells you that it's going to be a quick and easy product to work with. Uh, Distinctive is a uh, type of stamp that we have, and that is a um, patented type of stamp. This one gives you, lets you know that you can use the mini cut and emboss machine. And then um, this tells you whether, if it's available in English as well as French. So I do have some of my customers that actually speak, you know, have French speaking um, relatives and such. So that is helpful with them. We always have a little Q&A with Sarah, who is our awesome CEO. And um, then we have making a difference. Now, making a difference means that the products, when you purchase those products that, um, well, I didn't even read this one. <laughs> um, let's see. Hmm. Okay, it's just part of the mission. Okay, this is not, this is not a stamp set that gives back. Okay, but making a difference is something that we do love to do as demonstrators. Hey, Adriana, I'm glad that you are here and happy new year to you as well. And Simone is here, welcome. Okay, so this is the first suite that is in the new catalog and rightly so because this is showing us all the Valentine things. And I really like to think about February as the month of love. February the 14th is Valentine's Day, but you know what, we like to give little fun treats and we love giving um, cards and things all through the month of February. Many of us remember, have, have very fond memories of being in elementary school and having little mailboxes and cute little Valentine cards and kids still do that some. But I think if you grew up in the 50s or the 60s or the 70s, I think that those were probably the years that this really just was a huge, huge thing. Brings out the kid in all of us. But you know, look at these cute, adorable, adorable uh, suites. So this is the beautiful designer series paper. Super versatile. I'm actually featuring this at my uh, upcoming full weekend retreat, my winter retreat. We're featuring this, um, this designer series paper. It's also in my little Valentine class that I'm, I have a little class to go. And uh, so I'm featuring this. It has a gorgeous, let me see if I have it right here, this linen ribbon, and I know I can't go too, too long on every single one or I'll be here all day. Um, let's see, here we go. Let me just give you a little sneak peek. So this is one of the cards that we're making in my class to go. And this is a four by six card and um, uses some of these awesome dies. I absolutely love these dies. 
Look at this adorable little tiny, it gives you this little mini envelope, super cute. And um, these are the gems that are part of this. These are actually called iridescent rhinestones and they're super, super shiny, but they have a flat top. So they're gonna be a little, even easier to mail. And you can see how these papers work together. This is the ribbon that coordinates. And this is a red linen. So it's much lighter than like a satin. And I love because, you know, linen, you can dress linen up or down. Linen is such a classic fabric. Hey, Jackie, I'm glad you're joining us today. Um, linen is, is, is a classic fabric. And I love, love, love the way this ties. It's really, really nice. So this is not silky, but it's lightweight. So it's much lighter than a grow grain. And um, you can actually see through it just a wee bit if you hold it up to the light. Um, ties really nicely and it's not slick. So your, your bow stays really nicely. Um, while I have these here, these are just a couple of swaps that I got, again, using that adorable little um, mini envelope. Uh, that's gonna be a favorite. Lots of different hearts. Um, and you can see how these papers are just so, so cute. This one is a fancy fold, I believe. Yeah, this is really cute. Um, so again, this is a swap that I received. So it opens like this, isn't that cute? And this is kind of really showcasing so many of the different sides of this designer series paper. So you're gonna to wanna to get my class to go. Uh, it's a Valentine class to go. And so we're gonna be doing four full cards. We're gonna be doing uh, two mini cards, perfect for Valentine gifting. And then a couple of treats. So look how cute this is. So. And I love that, you know, these are those little, they're, they're the little conversation hearts that we all love uh, during Valentine's Day. So that's really, you know, this is sweet conversations. Conversation hearts is what this is all about. And I am in love with this sweet. Now I'm using, when I'm using it, I'm bringing in, um, and where you, you get one of these little boxes too with my class, so you can try that out. There's a new embossing folder, the gingham. Um, and here is, so here it's gonna show you again. This is more of the same. Isn't it just adorable? I love, love, love these little, like these little triples where you get the whole, you can stamp them all at once. You also have dies that will give you the outlines. Yeah, lots of fun things that you can layer with. And again, you can use these for baby. You can use them for birthday. You can use them for anniversary. Lots to, I mean, BFF, hug me. Text me, I know that is just so cute. Um, you are cute, happy to have you in my life. There is a happy Valentine's Day, but this goes way beyond just Valentine's. So I love the versatility that uh, they've brought us with that. Um, this, co this coordinates in a way. Um, you can use any of this with this, but I love, love, love. This is one of those, um, what do you call it? Uh, hybrid embossing folders. So you, you can cut and um, punch out all at the same time. Really cool dies and embossing folder and some sayings that you might really be looking for. So the wedding wishes to the cutest couple ever, uh, you know, to the one I love, happy wedding day. So anniversary is sometimes a little bit hard to find, celebrating your anniversary. Valentine greetings is a little bit more formal than the Happy Valentine's Day over here. So really classic fonts here. There's one for engagement, um, really awesome. And it comes as a bundle. So, you know, if you're gonna get these stamps, why not get the, the um, hybrid embossing folder as well? And we have this super cute uh, gumball greetings. And we do have dies that cut out every single part of this gumball machine, super cute, and then the cute little um, little domes that you can put the little tiny gumballs in. So adorable, absolutely adorable. Then we have, as you can see here, where this has been, this is the shaker card. This one is using the shaker card, but not with these little uh, gumballs in it, the frosted beads. This one is using some shapes for Valentine's Day. 
And then this one uses just the stamp. So I love that, you know, they're showing us different ways to do this. I do have some samples for you that I will show you um, on Thursday. Um, but this is super cute. This is definitely a kid-oriented Valentine stamp set, nuts and bolts. Super cute for girls and boys. I love that. Um, so that is nuts and bolts. Now this calls my name. <laughs> I love, love tulips and Flowering Feels Sweet is a mega sweet. And that means that we have gorgeous designer series paper and we have two bundles. So yeah, this is, I'm already making plans for cool things to do with this. Um, this has, this ribbon here is a window pane. Um, so this is another one that you can really dress up or down. And I, I think I keep seeing a lot of that in this particular catalog. Um, these are adorable, tiny, tiny brass um, butterflies. And I love that they're super flat. So they're not gonna raise your envelopes up at all. They're flat, but they're shiny and they're brushed. At, this paper is to die for, yeah. And look at the colors in it. Poppy Parade, Petal Pink. Poppy's my favorite red. Petal's my all-time favorite Stampin' Up! color. Pumpkin Pie, Pear Pizzazz, Pool Party, and Highland Heather. You got a mixture of um, a lot of our subtles with a little pop of bright. And yeah, there's a lot to love here. Now here, we are going, we're still in the same mega suite. So this is the breakdown of, oh, hey, Stella. I'm so glad you're here. And Marlene is here. Yay, and you know what, Stella, I'm having, um, you signed up for my email newsletter and I'm hitting your, um, I think I'm hitting your spam folder. Um, this is a gorgeous, gorgeous bundle. I love it. I love the greetings. I love the things you can do. Look at how you can make these awesome 3D tulips and look how they've put a, a layer of vellum to soften all those colors. And then that makes those tulips really stand out. Um, look at the yellows, look at the reds. Look, now here they've done it, not used the designer series paper, but this is um, soft succulent and, um, what's it called, not purple posy. <laughs> I can't think of it now. Um, aye, aye, aye. And it's not sweet sugar plum. You know, the new, fresh freesia. I knew it was a, I knew it was a flower. So there is just a lot to love there. And the, look at this, it's such an interesting bundle here. First of all, I love the fact that you have a 3D windmill. I mean, that is just really cool. And then 3D uh, fields of tulips. But look at this, how you can do some really fun things by layering these up and look how it looks. It's, the perspective is like you're looking at a field of tulips. And the little bicycle is a die. Isn't that cute? There's gonna be, yeah, this is gonna be a lot of fun. And it does tell you that windmill, windmill fields dies work with the mini cut emboss. So um, again, kind of watching for your icons that both of these bundles work with the mini cut emboss machine. So, you know, the mini machine is, is just $60. It, you can do a lot with it. So I think that that's really good to note. Now here is something that is super fun and bright. And you know what I did not bring over here is my celebration book. Let me grab that for you so we can look at it at the same time. My studio is in transition, getting all of the um, retiring things from the holiday put away and all the new things categorized. Um, without, well, let's see. I probably should go through this one by one, but what I wanted to show you was this coordinates. So 
Once again, Stampin' Up! is brilliant, and they're giving us things that coordinate in the two books. So there is this adorable rainbow paper, Sunshine and Rainbows Designer Series paper. This is six by six paper you can get free. If you like rainbows, this is super cute. So this is the bundle that coordinates with it, and you can just do a lot. Now, having said that, if you like, you can get this paper for free, even if you don't get this bundle, but just to show you that they do coordinate. So I think that's really brilliant. Speaking of coordination, you're gonna love this. This is, an, I love the whimsical design here of this particular stamp set. It's only a $17 stamp set. I mean, how can you say no to that? This should be on your wish list. It coordinates, look here, with our reindeer punch. So the reindeer punch, you can punch out this adorable fawn or this deer. Uh, I think it's a fawn because it has little speckles on the back. And we have a lot of fawns around in our, or we have a lot of deer in our neighborhood. And so we see a lot of these young fawns. Isn't this adorable for little spring images, the little mushrooms and super cute. So this coordinates here. You can punch out that deer. There is also this cloud punch. So that's a new punch, and I think there's gonna be a lot of fun things that you can do with that. And that punch, I believe, is just available on its own. I don't believe that's part of a suite. There's some new, um, new sequins, and they are called Sparkle and Shine. They're little mini sequins, really tiny. Now this, I mean, I love ladybugs. This is a fun, fun bundle. I've already been creating and playing with this quite a bit. This, I think, needs to be on your wish list, on your shopping list. And just remember, this is the January to June catalog, so it does go all the way through to June. But January and February are the times that you can order and, and get something free with every $50 or $100 you spend. So, you know, kind of... Look at your budget. I like to put my, my wish list together first, my shopping list, my you know, put everything on there that I want first. And then I start going through and do my second pass to the catalog and start making decisions on anything I need to cut and what I want to get first. So um, this is another, just a really affordable stamp set. This is lovely. This is called Wildflower Path. I just ordered it today. So um, you'll be seeing things with this. Um, lots of fun things that you can, you can make these little fields of flowers. You can do little backgrounds. You can do a lot of fun things. You can see they already have the aqua painter out. And look at these lovely words. Let's see if I can read it upside down. Do not go where the path may lead. Go instead where there is no path and leave a trail. Ralph Waldo Emerson. Beautiful saying. Happy birthday. Thank you. My heart is smiling because of you. Isn't that a lovely thing to share with someone? So very kind of artsy looking um, artwork here. Beautiful casual font. Looks like you've just handwritten that. So there's a lot to recommend with Wildflower Path. Just a single stamp set. $22 and just think of all the things you can do with that. Just with a single stamp set. Now this is what I chose for my January Cards with a Twist class. So that tells you right there that I absolutely love it. I'm drinking a cup of tea while I'm, while I'm sharing with you guys because that's what we do. We sit down, you know, you wanna get your catalog out, you wanna get your beverage of choice, and I'm pretty much always gonna be drinking a cup of tea. And, uh, and just browse, and I wanted to browse with you guys. So this symbol of fortune, symbols of fortune, I fell in love with this. Um, I shared in my blog post about this that when I was growing up in the 60s that my dad was in Vietnam, and when he came back, um, he brought beautiful treasures from the Orient and um, later went back several times for shorter tours and brought things from Bangkok, things from Vietnam, things from even Japan and different places. So I know that the crane is a universal symbol. In almost every culture, cranes are symbols of prosperity, of good fortune, things like that. So um, 
there's just a real elegance to this suite. I love the paper has gold foiling. And if you haven't already seen it, I did do a video that shows all of the eight cards that I created for you with this. Um, the stamp set is a, and the bundle is an add on. If you want, look at those gorgeous ginkgo leaves. I love them. Um, and the, the crane is just gorgeous. So let me see. Oh, here we go. So if you look at the breakdown, this chrysanthemum spray is just to die for. And these, both of these have the, these large stamps have that quality where they look, they look like they're airbrushed. They look like they already have dark and light shading on them just when you stamp them in a single color. Uh, beautiful greetings. Uh, these little dragonflies are lovely to use. You've got a little bit of ground. Uh, the dyes are really easy to use. Now there's like the paper is so gorgeous to use. This mother of pearl paper is so unique and I really love it. I'm actually using it a little bit in my Valentine class. So if you can see this white, super sparkly, it's not, it's flat. There's no glitter on it, but it's, it's like holographic. It's really, really shiny and gorgeous. And I love it for just a little pop of bright white um, shine, shimmer and shine. So this mother of pearl paper, it's only $6 for two sheets of 12 by 12. These are very delicate and lovely. These polished dots, you're going to love them. And then this ribbon is very, very lush. Now I used a gold ribbon with mine. I, I didn't, I didn't use this particular, um, I think this is soft succulent. Um, it actually wasn't available when we were doing our pre-order. And I used these doilies in my class. You know, I love doilies. So, um, and the fact, again, you can do all of these dies in your MIDI cut and emboss machine. So, pretty amazing stuff. This is a beachy, beachy scenes that you can make. This is called Paradise Palms Bundle. Really gorgeous. Look at the greetings on here. I, I love that you have a retirement a birthday, wishing you a warm and beauty, beachy kind of day, warm and beachy kind of day, that's fun. Hope you find a little paradise wherever you may be. Lovely, lovely images. You can do a lot of real fun, um, artsy, uh, technique -y things with this. Hey, Veronica, I'm glad you're here. We're doing a little walk through the, the uh, mini catalog. So this is another bundle and just kind of classic images. This is really, really excellent for newer stampers. And um, having said that, it would appeal to anybody. But I do like to point out when things are really workable for newer stampers. Um, the bundle is only $34, so that's a great deal. $20 stamp set with some excellent greetings and really bold designs. That punch, because you get two little boughs and blossoms bundle, but look at those two little branches you get. There's a lot to love with that. Now, this is adorable. Of course, you know me, I love my creatures, and I especially, I used to collect rabbits. My first child is my daughter. I did her whole nursery in Peter Rabbit. Um, have a an absolute love affair with Beatrix Potter and all of those stories and images. These are just charming, absolutely charming. So this little Easter stamp set, yeah, it's Eastery, but you could also um, just do all kinds of cute baby things with this or just cute. So, and I love here where they're showing you how you can just keep this, you can do really simple stamping with this. You can just stamp that bunny. You don't have to do anything, you know, fussy with it because all of the artwork is gonna do the work for you. This is a beautiful, beautiful, if you like gardening or if you have someone in your life that likes gardening, this garden greenhouse bundle is really lovely. This has more graphic um, type, uh, bold, more graphic type um, leaves rather than like realistic looking ones. So really lovely, a friendship, a friendship natured in, Oh, nurtured in love, I'm reading upside down. <laughs> Blooms forever, isn't that lovely? Each day is a new beginning. Hope your day is just right and love grows here. Love, love, love that. So gorgeous dyes, gorgeous. Uh, and again, look at that. You can use your mini cut and emboss. I tell you, they're doing some amazing things with that. And um, this is showing you exactly how that works, how you can put those through. 
And then there's a sneak peek of that cute watering can, and that is gorgeous. You know, we had a, uh, there's actually a uh, kit, um, a kit collection kit that has a little bit of these rain boots in it and some cute images. This really uh, just takes that and runs with it. Only $49 for this bundle that cuts out all of these images. And look how you can take the boots on their own. You know, we spent nine years in England. We called these Wellington boots and they are, you know, true rain boots, mud boots, whatever you want to call them. Uh, but look how you can add the tulips there. You can add uh, some greenery there. You could even add these little daisies there. All kinds of different things that you can do. You can add them to the watering can, to the pot. Yeah, this is just, to me, this is like gardening without having to get your hands dirty. I mean, yeah, you might get some ink on your hands, but that's a lot easier to wash off than a bunch of soil. Super, super cute. Um, this is the Kite Delight, $18. This is a, this is a real steal. And um, great stamp set for boys and girls. You know, kites are just kind of universal. Again, I love the um, universality of the appeal there for the kites. Lots of fun things you can do with those. From simple stamping to fun, um, really fun techniques and things. This is absolutely gorgeous. I, you know, I, I, yeah, I'm in love with this suite. It's, I love, um, yeah, it's, it's tropical and it's kind of graphic and bold. And let me tell you, these are adorable. Let me see if I, I think I have them right here. This is a really unusual thing here. So this, this is white frayed ribbon. If it grow grain, if you had the blushing bride one from the holiday catalog, this is like a really wide version of that where it has kind of rugged ends. Um, these are just, I think I'm going to use them in this suite, but I think I'm going to use them way beyond this. These are like little tiny pebbles or like sea glass is what they remind me of. So you get them in clear, um, that looks to me like maybe pear pizzazz and maybe pool party or coastal cabana. They're just delicate. Look how delicate. I think they're going to be so much fun to work with. Um, really gorgeous, uh, greens here. Lots of greens with pops of Calypso Coral and Pale Papaya. Yeah, and then a coordinating vellum. There's a lot to love here. So this is probably, probably gonna be in a, the uh, Cards with a Twist class coming up for me. Okay, I gotta hurry. So this is the stamp set that, that actually, this, this suite, so here's the actual stamp set. Look how big those are. Huge, huge leaves, and look at those gorgeous, gorgeous greetings. Um, yeah, there is a lot to love here. And even, this is almost hidden, but look, that's an actual stamp. It's like a little, um, like an aged piece of a, um, like a, a gardening journal or an, uh, a, a dictionary. I love that. And this, I think you could use, this, this is, although I think it's supposed to be seeds, it almost looks like hearts. I think you could use this for Valentine's. And I love that happiest birthday wishes. That's a gorgeous, gorgeous greeting. Sending all the hugs. <coughs> Beautiful. Okay, here we go. Another bundle, Dahlia Days bundle. This, now you see how the size, look how large these are. And look at how small these are in comparison. So this is a much smaller, tidier. Uh, this is really large and bold. This is much smaller. This has one of those... Um, dies that cuts all of those dahlias out. So really excellent greetings, gorgeous. Okay, here we go. This is a fun stamp set to use. $25, all just stamps. Look at that. No dies or anything. You have, I believe these are distinctive. Yep, these are distinctive. So it has that really cool look to it and excellent greetings. Tons of things you can do with that. This, I've already, I shared this on my blog, I believe, already. So this was one of my sneak peek items, uh, making an Easter card. I'm in love with this. I think I'm going to be doing a home decor piece with these daffodils. These are gorgeous. Now, let me show you really quick. In the celebration book, I showed you the paper that coordinates with the rainbows. Well, yes, there is paper that coordinates with the daffodils, and it is beautiful. So here we have daffodil afternoon paper. 
Isn't this gorgeous? So this coordinates. So see, this Daffodil Dreams is $54.75. If you buy that bundle, you can get this coordinating paper for free. I mean, that's a great coordination and a great deal that you would get designer series paper for free with the bundle. So this, I believe, is a must-have. You've got those little paint spatters, which are always super versatile to use. And yeah, lots to love here. Lots, lots, lots to love. Because you can look, look, see these 3D? 3D daffodils. I love daffodils and tulips. All the spring bulb flowers are just gorgeous. We have another kind of under the sea for you here. Seize the day. Some really cute, um, but kind of light and delicate uh, in the feel of these uh, seaside images. This is a distinctive stamp set as well. So one stamp and you're going to get a lot to uh, a lot of um, kind of color texturing and layering with that. This is this ocean front. A lot of fun scenes you can do with that. I mean, look, yeah, look at that right there. Now this, hmm, this is distinctive as well. So you can do these together. You can do them separately. A lot of fun things here. I think there's dyes that go with this. So I think they're coming up. This I have, and this is super fun to play with. I love silhouette images. So three beautiful distinctive silhouettes, and then look at these dies that coordinate. So the dies are all words. You are amazing. There's a thanks, and there's a, well, of course there's a you. So really cool dies. And if you get them together, you get that bundle price of 10% off, which you don't want to miss. Um, this is our Eden's Garden, which we've had to play with for, I think about two months now. So totally different look because, of course, the designer paper is no longer. That was just for a limited time. I'm in love with this suite. So this is New Horizons. The paper, designer paper is absolutely gorgeous because it's all scenes that are done for you. I mean, look at that. That designer paper did all of that work for you. And then you could just come in here with the stamps. And um, this tells you, shows you the actual size. Um, but they'll give it to you on the next page. And again, we have some more of those little... They're like little stones. They're adorable, at little pebbles. And then this gorgeous ribbon that we have a little bit of misty moonlight and petal pink. Aren't those gorgeous together? And they're really thin grow grain ribbons. Uh, this I love. I've already gotten this, haven't played with it yet. But, um, oh, thank you, Jeanette, you're here. Hey there. Yeah, when the DSP just does it all for you, you gotta love that. I, I love gardening, and again, I like gardening with ink because you don't have to get your hands dirty. I don't do as much gardening now as I did when I was younger, but this there's just a lot to love here, so I think this is going to be fun to use. We've got a couple of brand new background stamps, uh, the Timeless Tiles and the Gentle Waves, so you can see here some fun things being done with that. These Swallows, Soaring Swallows, gorgeous. Look how you can... They're two-step stamping, so you can layer them up. And again, just beautiful birds, lots of fun things you can do with them. This has my name on it. <laughs> this is one that I really love, this Grassy Grove bundle, because there's my little deer. But look at all the scenes you can do, beautiful greetings. This is probably gonna be a, um, this is probably gonna be a Cards with a Twist. So yeah, I, I go through and that's kind of the first things I look for. And again, you can do all of these dies with your mini cut emboss, isn't that amazing? So this, I will tell you, Abstract Beauty, beautiful suite. And um, in full disclosure, this bundle will not be on my shelf. This, I don't do well with these like shapes like this. I do much better with more natural free flowing things. Uh, but I love people who can design with these graphics. Having said that, I adore the, the paper, the cards and envelopes, adore this ephemera pack, and adore the paper. So I will be working with these, but not with these. And that's just, you know, my, my personal taste. If you're an abstract person and you like these big shapes, I will, I will love looking at your projects. So here again is another stamp set that coordinates. Um, yeah, this, I've tried working with this kind of stuff. It just doesn't mesh with my style. This, I love, this does mesh with my style. I love, love, love these greetings. And the font is very light and whimsical and super delicate. I love it. Um, 
this is gonna be so fun to work with. And I have this, I just haven't worked with it yet. These are the slim card. Uh, we have slim cards and envelopes in our catalog which you could just purchase. And then we have these dies. Um, and these are kind of bold and graphic, but yeah, this is a little bit different for me. So I think this is gonna be fun. It's gonna stretch me a little bit. This I love. I'm, I've got, I'm gonna release the information hopefully tomorrow. I've got some online card classes coming up that anybody can watch for free. Um, you can get the packet if you want, but the, um, when you order, but the, the classes will be right here. They will be free. All celebrating birthdays. I've got four of them coming up in January and February, and this is one of the stamp sets I'm gonna be featuring. So cute and so fun. Um, here, now this is also, guarantee you this is gonna be a Cards with a Twist. Ranunculus Romance. Believe it or not, when I used to help my daddy garden a little bit and ranunculus were growing wherever we lived at the time. I moved a lot as a child because my dad was in the army. And so, uh, yeah, this, this speaks my name. When you have the, the Eiffel Tower and you have uh, this, you know, old looking postage stamp and, or uh, st um, postal stamp. And yeah, this is just, I love this. I've already started working with this. I absolutely adore it. Yeah, Romance Ranunculus. You want this. This needs to be on your wish list. Um, this is, again, some of those bold graphic words will not be on my, this is not on my wish list, but I think it's really cool for people who can design that real, that real kind of graphic kind of thing. This I love. Um, I'm going to be also using this on my uh, birthday card class, and I'm way over time. I'm supposed to get into the grocery store. Um, love, love, love this. This is actually um, inspired by one of our Million Dollar Achievers. And her name is Sam Hammond. She's in the UK. And I love the fonts here, the swirls, so much fun. Coordinates with, I think two different stamp sets. It coordinates with our flower punch. Maybe one more. Maybe two different stamp sets. This is super fun. We got this um, if, we, if you went to the Stampin' Up! convention, uh, online convention. They gave us this. So many fun things to do. And I, this is a lot of fun to work with. And then we have Heart and Home. We also got this at our convention. Gorgeous, gorgeous suite. I love this. The doilies are my favorite part of it. My second favorite part might be, I toss it between the designer paper and the hive embossing folder. But again, we have a mega suite, so we have two full-on bundles that coordinate. Um, there's also Memories and More card pack. So you'll be seeing lots of that. Here's one of the bundles. This is the one that I have. No, I think I have them both. This is gorgeous. Lots of fun to work with. And then this one, look at all those beautiful greetings and you, the really nice bumblebees. Three different bumblebees. And these are distinctive stamps, lots of flowers, fun things to work with. Yeah, these are the things that call my name. Um, flowers, um, more delicate images. A couple of big, bold, single stamps, fun to work with. Um, a very cutesy, um, kind of punny um, stamp set. Really cute for the young and the young at heart. Um, this, I love hedgehogs anyway. The fact that this one has a punch just makes me so happy because you can stamp these little hedgehogs, punch them out, and you can also punch out just his back. So this is adorable, adorable. You're going to be seeing me play with that. Um, I love greeting stamp sets, and this one has, I love all these different fonts. I love all these different sayings. Lots of fun things here. Celebrating you. Don't you love that? This, again, I already know people who are using this. This will not be. I love cactus, but this is too graphic-y, too bold. I need, I need cacti that are more like in your garden. So this will not be on my, you won't be seeing me use this, but I think it's super cute. And if you like that, that style, go for it. Same with this. Um, you see how it just goes with some of these other more graphic-y things. This is super cute for sports fans, but I will tell you that if you're not, like I'm not gonna be getting this bundle. It's just not something that is gonna be useful in my life at this point, even though my husband's a big baseball fan. Um, there's other aspects of him that I would be celebrating. Hey, Lisa, I'm glad you're here. Um, yeah, the coordination, Jackie, between these two catalogs is off the charts. 
But I will say, this paper, because I always get all the papers, the B side I love on all of these. I like the A side too, but the A side's a little busy for me. The B sides I love. So, and the twines are awesome. And these little stars, yeah. So there's things that I oftentimes like um, the consumables if I don't like the bundle. And I can't say I don't like it. I just It's just not gonna be useful for me. So I won't be getting it. And same with this little sailboat thing. It's I usually will get a bundle that has a punch. I don't think I'm gonna be getting this one. Unless somebody helps me fall in love with this, I think it's cute, but it just won't be for me. And see, they're using, look at that. They're using, that's kind of fun. Um, this is the, um, this baseball paper and they've made, um, these look like golf tees, I think. Really cute. Um, this I love, but I, you know, I always love the critters and the creatures. Love, love, love this. Definitely more on the masculine side, uh, wildlife wonder. And this is a distinctive stamp set. We have quite a few of those this time. And that this is really, I do, I love gardening, um, even though I don't do much of it these days, this is super cute. And I think that even though this has dad in it, yeah, this can be, you can you can make this feminine or masculine, lots to, lots of fun things to do with this. This is adorable, the little Viking stamp set. I already have a swap with this Brave Vikings. Really cute. Definitely for the young and the young at heart. And then this I just ordered. I didn't think I was gonna get it, but I just had to for the record, and then all kinds of cute sayings. Again, I grew up in the era of records, and this is just too cute to pass up. It's only $22, and I think it's gonna be super fun to play with. This tells you the things that are carrying over from our holiday book, and will continue to be available. Of course, this punch, because it coordinates with that adorable little springtime stamp set. So that is my walk through the mini catalog. I didn't get to go all the way through this, but I will be sharing more about celebration on Thursday when I'm here with you for more uh, Facebook Live at my new time of four o'clock. I got to get to the grocery store and uh, get dinner on the table. Um, I'm cooking tonight. Uh, tomorrow my son's cooking, so I'm grateful for that. Um, so yeah, Thursday I'll be sharing with you some of my swaps because I've got some great samples to share that I've created. I've been playing with a lot of these things, but also um, some um, swaps that, uh, from some other demonstrators, from my team and some other demonstrators. So I hope you've enjoyed uh, my catalog walkthrough. I find it helpful for me to go through it kind of page by page and just to kind of show you the things that are really piquing my interest and hopefully draw some things out from you so that when you're looking at it that you kind of see some things that might be of interest to you and might be of note for you. So I hope you're getting a big wish list ready and um, I didn't go over it too much today just in my, in my email news, but you know, during celebration, starting today and all the way through the end of February, you get something free with every $50 you spend. And there's some things you can get free when you spend 100 So there's just a lot, uh, there's a lot of free right now. And you want to use your shopping wisely. So this is the time to really start shopping. And um, yeah, I will talk to you again on Thursday. Thank you so much for tuning in. Take care and God bless.